Hey, so if you're new to our channel, we're Matt and Nat, and in 2021, we visited all 50 U.S. states as part-time travelers and documented our experiences with a new vlog and blog for each state. So if you haven't watched our 50 States in a Year series, we'll link it above. Now, when most people hear that we visited all 50 states, they quickly assume that we're either RVers or van lifers, and that would be pretty cool if we were, but we actually visited all 50 states as part-time travelers with non-remote jobs, which pretty much just means we're crazy. Yeah. <laughs> and while our ultimate goal is to be doing this full-time, we didn't want to let our current situation stop us from living life to the absolute fullest. There's a quote that's become a mantra in our lives, and it says, it's better to see something once than hear about it a thousand times, and honestly, we couldn't agree more. The fact is, most people are in similar situations as us, working non-remote jobs with a limited number of vacation days. And if that's you, we hope that we can encourage you to get out and find your own adventure with whatever amount of time you have, because it is so worth it, and you can do and see so much in even a short amount of time. Some of our favorite comments on this channel are when someone tells us that they just got back from a destination they would have never thought of until they saw our video. Or when someone comments and says that they made a once in a lifetime memory doing an experience that we featured right here on our channel. Or when a local comments on our video saying that they learned something about their city <laughs> from one of our videos. I guess what we're trying to say is that we love helping others travel and see the world through destinations and experiences that they may otherwise never have even thought of. And we are not stopping anytime <laughs> soon. Which brings us to our main point of this video, which is what's next for our channel. After visiting all 50 states, we went on a handful of different trips throughout this year, and one of those trips was to Key West, Florida. While we were there, we visited a local bookstore and came across the book 1,000 Places to See Before You Die and were immediately drawn in by it. So we opened up the book and started skimming through and saw that many of the places that we'd been during our 50 states travels were actually in the book. Then we were curious to see what else was in there, and the more that we dug, the more that we realized that this had to be a part of our adventures. Now, I'm not gonna act like it didn't take some convincing on Natalie's part yeah. to get me on board with That's this. true. Because a thousand places is a whole lot of places, and the fact is, 50 states in a year was a daunting task. That's so, because it was. <laughs> so a thousand places is honestly just quite terrifying. <laughs> but after a few months of going back and forth trying to figure out how this fits into our journey, it finally clicked. I realized that we don't have to see all 1,000 places, and it was more about the journey to see as many of the 1,000 places that we could in our lifetime. That said, we are so excited to take you guys along as we attempt to see as many of the 1,000 places to see before you die. I mean, technically it's before we die, but you know. Well, I guess actually, yeah. <laughs> One of the things that we loved so much about the 50 States travels was the variety. From national parks to big cities to small towns and everything in between, it was always something new and fresh. And that is what excites us so much about this new series as well. From things like exploring the medieval and Renaissance history in Florence, Italy, to taking in the sights and the smells of the German Christmas markets to autumn leaf peeping in the Great Smoky Mountains and so much more, this series is going to have something for everyone. So we hope that you'll hit that subscribe button as well as the notification bell to join us on the adventure.